All right, what is your name slash title? My name is Shen Kuang Wu. Uh, I'm an assistant professor. All right, what is the classes that you teach or have taught? Uh, currently, I'm teaching a uh, civil engineering materials class and also statics, and also plus a one lab for the civil engineering materials. All right, why did you choose civil engineering? I think this can be a very long story. You know, originally I do not want to study civil engineering. My original idea was trying to do a, a international business or like international trade. Uh, that was my interest. Uh, I changed because my actually my family, you know, they, 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 they thought that actually could be a very good career. Basically, you can find a job, you know, very easily, uh, you know, from that you know, standpoint. So, but later on, you know, I get a uh, all the experience, you know, from the uh, civil engineering firm, you know. I felt like I liked that a lot, so that's why I changed my major and then started the civil engineering. So, uh, but uh, I think overall, I think I, I think I made a good decision, uh, even though that decision was m not made by me originally. So, all right, what discipline are you and why? Uh, I think I'm a, in the pavement engineering and across the uh, sustainability engineering. Um, the reason I think is also based on my past experience. I got my PhD at Washington State University, you know, studying the asphalt pavement, uh, some like a green technology, you know, so they can reduce a lot of a, uh, energy uh, consumption and also uh, pollution, so which is actually also going to be a, a the field for the uh, sustainability. Uh, so uh, once you know, you get a more exposure to those kind of things, so that's actually become your uh, your career. So. Later on, or, uh, after I graduated from Washington State, I went to University of Illinois uh, as a, a senior sustainability research engineer. Uh, so basically my job was to promote uh, sustainability uh, with the uh, Illinois Department of Transportation. So um, of course, you know, uh, this is a really huge market actually, uh, combined the pavement and also sustainability uh, in the all areas you know, of the transportation. All right. How long have you taught at South Alabama? Uh, so I came here in in August. So so far, I think at two months. All right. What makes the program here at South special? Um, I have to say, uh, first of all, we have a very diverse faculties. You know, we're from different areas. You know, pavement sustainability, structure, coastal, uh, because you know we are in the uh, the deep south, and I think we have a very a very uh, good program, you know, for the coastal engineering. So, uh, of course, you know, we, we, we do also have a traditional uh, civil engineering subjects. And also we have uh, some very cool program, you know, actually the one uh, I initiated that is about the uh, study board program. So, um, I think it's going to be the next question. But anyway, yeah, I think that's also special about uh, um, the University of South Alabama. So, we have a very uh, friendly and also diverse uh, faculty, uh, we are always here, you know, to provide anything for students. What advice do you have for a student while they are here at South? You mean that for freshmen or for for any student? For mainly freshmen. Uh, I would say just enjoy your life, right? Basically, but uh, of course, it's not easy. It's not easy to enjoy your life, basically, because you have uh, so many things going on. You have to take the class. You have to make sure your GPA is as high as possible, and also you have to take all the activities. You know, um, go to the clubs, you know, organizations. So this is very important actually for your career-wise. So uh, I would say enjoy your life basically, but also keep a balance of life between your um, personal life and also uh, your your study. What is your advice for someone after graduation? Um, of course, you need to find a job before you graduate. I think that's the most important. Otherwise, you're I don't know how 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 gonna make life you know anywhere. So uh, after graduation, I think I'm supposed you have a job, right? So uh, work hard, no matter what it is, because it's your first job. I remember I remember my first job. Uh, um, I think it's easy actually. You know, my my first job was more, way easier than I was starting uh, at Washington State. You know, as a PhD student. So. Uh, but I think that's the experience, you know, can help you grow, basically. Uh, the tough you experience, I think the easier life you're going to get in the later. So, uh, basically, just work hard. Of course, again, enjoy your life. Is there any, any research or study abroad that you are a part of? Yeah, since I, uh, as I mentioned earlier, I came here just in August. So, uh, some research I'm doing right now, uh, I think it's zero. 
No. So basically, I, I need to figure it out, and of course, you know, I can uh, 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 do more uh, research regarding the pavement performance and also the uh, sustainability. And of course, you know, starting program, uh, I initiate that uh, starting program, I think, in China. I think it's coming out. I think it's going to be in uh, May uh, 2018. So, of course, I'm going to welcome anyone who are interested in, you know, kind of comparing uh, the civil engineering infrastructure between the U.S. and China. And then I think that would be a great opportunity, you know, for you to get those experience. All right. Is there anything else you would like to add? Uh, what do you want to say? I think uh, Daniel is a good student. Right, that's what he wants to hear, I think, so far, and then uh, uh, that's for him basically. You know, um, I think uh, he's a, he's a really good, you know, always like communicate with the professor, you know, uh, just to keep uh, post uh, what, what uh, you are, are doing, uh, and um, and also, you know, trying to uh, take advantage, you know, advantage of all the professors, I think. I think communication is really important, no matter where you are, you know, for your career or for your study, you know, just uh, make sure you and other people, especially you are on the team, you know, on the same page. So I, I think that that's pretty much what I want to say. Again, enjoy your life. All right, thanks.